Witness Underground podcast update. Very exciting news this week. Witness Underground is now available to watch. Patreon.com forward slash Witness Underground. This is a perfect time to join. The podcast is fully active. Updates are coming every couple weeks. Two exciting other things have happened. We were just featured on two different podcasts in the XJW space. Both of them are great. I love both of them for very different reasons. One's called Bad Associations Podcast, like Badass, capital A-S-S, Bad Associations, which is a play on words if you're not from this religious culture. Um, anyone who was outside the religion is definitely Bad Association. Anyone inside the religion who was breaking some small rules could be deemed Bad Association. That's a negative label. The host of the podcast, Chev Clark, is owning this title. We are the Bad Associations. I love it. I think it's really funny. And one of the tiers on our Patreon has also been Bad Association. I think I even actually like made fun of it being badass, uh, as she does in her podcast title. Check it out. She does a great job. And she just had me on. And it was really a fun conversation. It's two hours long. I apologize for the length. And she really cut that down because I think her conversation was four hours long. She mostly cut herself out, unfortunately. But yeah, it's time. Um, she's trying to highlight my project and enjoy all the crazy things I have to say. And it was really fun. I listened back to her as cracking myself up and she was cracking me up. Like it was a really fun conversation. It went a lot of places. So I love that recording. And then this morning, Stephen Mather of the Cult Hackers podcast out of the UK, out of London. He interviewed me for another revisit of our conversation. We had a, a podcast episode. The first time we did it together was in the end of 2021 at the end of the film festival run or at the beginning of 2022 with Ryan Sutter, who's in Witness Underground, as one of the two main stories that we follow through the film. So they had, him and Celine had us on, and that was really fun, and we've since developed a really great relationship. So this is a really fun conversation. We really dove into a few topics. Kind of surprisingly, actually, we, we talked ahead of the conversation, what we're gonna talk about, and as two people that are from the same culture, even though we're from worlds apart, come together, we just can go anywhere with this conversation. And one of the things that we really got into, which was kind of surprising and fun, was human sacrifice. And there's like three big pillars to what makes this religion a cult. The biggest one, in my opinion, is shunning. It is what makes them a cult, this act. They, they are very strict about it. It destroys families. It destroys bonds of, of family and friendships and community permanently. Like they really go out of their way to make sure that these relationships are destroyed and they create a wall around themselves and create an insular, internal, almost like a, a jail where they, they shut the door themselves. They even It's not even locked. They're just like not coming out and they won't talk to anyone who's outside of the jail, the trap. They probably would see it differently, but if you're on the outside, it just... That's really what it feels like and looks like. Everyone who's left this religion has dealt with this on some usually very extreme level, and it's a form of abuse. We get into that. We get into human sacrifice, and that comes down to, and that's maybe a salacious way of looking at it or melodramatic, but convince me that it's not human sacrifice. Over 30,000 people have died, according to the American Medical Association. So we get into that a little bit, and there's a great movie that just came out about it. And we talk about that a little bit. And then he really wanted to highlight the grant project that we have going on witnessunderground.com. You can apply if you want to make something creative, any kind of creative outlet of any kind. The primary ones, I guess, would be music and visual arts of some kind, video, film. Uh, but we have the people who come on the podcast who are authors. And someone wrote in, applied, who wants to do character drawings. Other people are painters. So really anything, the panel of people who will be looking at the different applications and deciding who to go with to win $1,000 to be granted the money are mostly musicians and filmmakers. So there's that. But I'm thinking about bringing on an author and um, it's just a matter of who, who's willing to put in the time to like go over these ideas or these different um, art expressions that he'll want to do. And we hope to keep on doing that. So like any money that comes through the Patreon, 20% of it goes into a pool, which then becomes the grant money for the next grant contest. So we want to keep that going. So if you, if you like the, what we're doing with the film, you like what we're doing with the other interviews we're doing for, with other people, with the XW coming out project, which is still ongoing. There'll be a number of episodes this year, mostly focused on the season three, which would be anyone related to the movie. So the five people in the movie, we have their raw interviews and I hope to cut some smaller pieces from that. And there's like once a quarter, I guess a little sooner than every, every two months I'll probably put something out. So I guess I'm due to put one out real soon here. So try to knock one of those out in March. Go check out Badass, Bad Association's podcast. It's everywhere podcasts can be heard. She runs on Anchor, so it's distributed everywhere. And then Cult Hackers is also everywhere. Stephen and Celine Mather. 
she's getting married, so she might have a different name. But those two, father, daughter, he's a psychologist, and he's been out for 30 years, and she's never been associated with religion. So it's like an interesting duality where someone who doesn't know about it is asking someone who knows it about it intimately and from a psychological or scientific, more scientific perspective. I love both those podcasts so much, and I want to do anything I can to spread the love and uh, go check them out. If you like what I'm doing, you probably like what they're doing even more. I think that they have, they're very dedicated and uh, they're doing a great job in very different ways. Uh, Chev Clark's Bad Associations, he kind of interviews someone deeply and they just go down every rabbit hole. Stephen and Celine are focused on having a concise, like one hour program with maybe someone deep in the religion or someone who's on the psychological, like psychology side or from another religion. I love both styles. They're completely different and I like both of them so much and they're great people. So please go support both of those podcasts, Cult Hackers and Bad Associations. Apply for the grant, get on our Patreon, and we're starting this month a monthly meetup online, and I use StreamYard for that. It's a software. I will invite anyone who's on the Patreon to join that, and I hope to do something like a bucket list conversation, like a themed conversation where we dive into what do you want to do before you die, and then let's try to do all the stuff this year. Come on, let's, uh, let's make the list. Let's get excited about what's next. Like Anything's possible. Something inspiring, and then maybe we'll do different themed ones about maybe art and art expression. I want to get to know everybody this way as well. Thanks again, everybody, for checking in. Witness Underground is now available to watch. Patreon.com forward slash Witness Underground. Witnessunderground.com. Apply for the grant. I'll see you next time.